so today I'm going to be filming my Christmas gift guide for her for the third time I think it is. The first time cut out halfway through, the second time my battery just died so uh, fingers crossed that this will actually work because I'm getting so sick and tired of showing the same things over and over again. Um, but yeah, I'm just going to get straight into it, you know the drill, I'm going to show some products that are generally more high end, sort of, they're generally bigger presents, so the sort of things that you would gift someone as a whole present as opposed to little presents if that makes sense. So if you're looking for more stocking filler type things then I have already done a video on that, um, I will link that down below and I've also done one for the guys which features only like five things or something but um, there's a few things in there which I think pretty much suit most guys so you can check that one out as well which will also be down there. Need a bit of Dutch courage in the form of cola balls. Mm. Also in my onesie if you couldn't already tell. So first up is the Magnetone Lucid. This one is limited edition by Pixie Lot but they all pretty much do the same thing. Um, this is basically just another standard cleansing brush. Um, I think it basically does the same as you know the Clinique, the Clarisonic. Um, apart from this one, I think it looks a lot nicer to be fair. I mean you can get loads of different colours and I mean it's a lot cheaper. I think you can get it for like £50 or so. So it's not an extortionate price whereas I think the Clarisonic are like over £100. I swear you can even get one for £200 or something which is just ridiculous. But I've been using it for about 10 days, 2 weeks now and I absolutely love it. I haven't noticed any irritations on my skin at all and I've got quite sensitive skin sometimes. So this is what it looks like. Um, pink and pixie lot as you can tell so if someone's a big fan of pixie lot might be a good idea but you've got this really soft bristles it still wet it's been in my shower but wait for it Ugh. okay so it's covered in water and now I've got a wet face let's not turn this on um, yeah basically it's like your standard cleansing brush you can go in your shower like I said that's where I leave mine um, I just chuck a little bit of my favourite cleanser on there. I'm, at the moment I'm using the Origins Ginseng Scrub Cleanser or something. But I just pop a little bit on the brush and then go over my face for a minute. And it turns off after a minute so you're not going to over scrub your face or anything. So yeah, these are like £50 and they're pretty much available anywhere. Next is something that I've already forgotten how much it cost. Um, I know it's pretty pricey for what it is. Um, it's a hair perfume and it's by Show Beauty and it smells exactly like creme brulee. This basically is just a really luxury gift for someone that literally has everything. Everyone wears perfume but everyone also gets perfume for Christmas and for birthdays, it's kind of a bog standard gift. Um, but this is a hair perfume so it's kind of a little bit different, it's really luxurious looking, um, really luxuriously priced as well. I think it might be around £30 but it might even be more than that, I will have to double check. But I just think it just looks really really nice on a dressing table and as a product, I mean, I think it just, it comes in a really nice box, I've thrown it away because I've had this for quite a while now, um, but it just looks really nice presentation wise, so I think anyone would be pretty happy with that, and who doesn't like creme brulee smelling hair, I mean. Speaking of bog standard fragrance gifts, um, there's nothing wrong with a bog standard fragrance gift, I personally would love to receive this, it's the Chloe Signature Gift Set, and I've just, that's the lid, let's get rid of that. Um, this set comes with a, I think it's either 30 or 50 ml fragrance, doesn't quite say, doesn't quite say, and then a larger size body lotion. So again, pretty standard, but obviously they're just a really nice thing to receive. I know for me personally, I always run out of my favourite fragrance at growing Christmas. So to get a set with a brand new fragrance that people just know I love, then it's just great. I think this retails for around £50, and obviously with the gift sets, I mean the body lotions or the shower gels, they're basically a freebie, um, you're basically paying for this part and then you kind of just get the freebie on the end. So if you are ever looking to buy someone, you know, a gift, a fragrance gift, then always try and go for the coffre because at the end of the day they normally cost the same and they also come with the extra bit. So that's just a little insider's tip, though I'm not an insider whatsoever. A personal favourite for me is this Neom Christmas set, um, you might be wondering where is the other part of the set, you know it's not really much of a set when you only get one thing. Um, it's back there, if you can see it burning, the candle at the front, because this one is completely dead so I've now moved on to the second one. Um, this one's perfect piece and it smells of pine, myrrh and lime peel. Now let me just check, that one's Christmas Wish 
and it smells of mandarin, cinnamon and tonka bean apparently. This one's kind of more like a fresh scent and this one really is like a rich Christmassy scent. So um, I love them both the same but I kind of wanted to burn that one closer to Christmas just because it kind of felt a bit more Christmassy to me. Um, the set comes at like £50, I think it costs around £50. But you get two neon candles that are just amazing. Neon candles, neon candles are my absolute favourite. I've got another one burning back there, the little tiny one that's pretty much run out as well. Um, but they're just such a great gift. If you are stuck for what to buy someone, then they're just great because who doesn't like a nice smelling candle? So next is this completely battered looking Elegant Touch Luxe Gel Starter Kit. That was a bit of a mouthful. And this is basically gel nails at home. I've had a bit of a play around with it, but haven't really done too much. Purely because I'm holding out for a black nail polish in my local boots that just hasn't quite come yet. Um, but let me just get some of it out without making too much noise. It's sort of your standard UV... Thing. I don't, I'm not really a pro when it comes to nails, as again, you can see, I think I just swore at the camera. Um, just, you know, pop your nails in there. And I just think these are a really, really good gift for someone that loves to do their nails. These sets come with two, two gel polishes, um, Material Girl and Sweet Dreams, but I think they probably do other colours as well. Um, and yeah, I just think it's a really, really nice kit for someone that does their nails all the time but like me complains about nail polish chipping or just I don't know I'm not sure what other issues there are with nail polish apart from it chipping but um, yeah I just think it's a really good idea it does last for about two weeks maybe a little bit less but I'm the sort of person that's really cat candid and I will just go and I don't know I'll start sanding something randomly and wonder where my nail polish falls off but these are always on offer I think as well so I will link it down below I won't give you a definitive price because at the moment I don't know what it is but they're always like on sale or something so I will link the best deal down below for you. A great gift for someone that travels quite a lot is this Conscious Skincare Set. Uh, not 100% sure what the name of it is but it basically comes with a bunch of Conscious Skincare products. You get the Sweet Orange and Frangipani Body Oil, Grapefruit and Rosewood Bath Soak, um, the Grapefruit Body Lotion, let me see, I'm running out of hands. A body polish, and I know you get a body butter as well, because this is one of my personal favourite things. Um, not ever, but you know, like, body butter wise. And then a grapefruit and cedarwood body wash. So, these are just really, really great products as a whole. Um, I know you can buy bigger sets as well, so you could always buy the, there's like a luxe body kit that I think I might want to get my hands on. This is obviously also a great introduction to the brand. They're not that popular, I don't really know why, because they really are, like, such nice products. I absolutely love the body butter, it's kind of like a foamy mousse, and then you put it on your skin and it just turns into an oil, which I am all about. So, yeah, I just think this is a really, really good gift, and it's not too expensive. I think it's one of the cheaper things in this gift guide. Again, prices have completely just gone over my head, so I will put them all down below. I'm sure we all recognise this box, so... This is basically what dreams are made of. It's not just a box that I'm interested in, although it is very nice, but it's the pomegranate noir candle. Um, I was sent one of these and I've had to pick up another one. They're just, oh God, they are so, so nice. I know who I'm giving this to Christmas, to for Christmas. Um, I just think it's great for anyone, again, that's maybe more like a grandparent or someone a little bit older, maybe someone that's just moved into a new home. Um, but the pomegranate noir scent in itself is amazing. I'm gonna get the actual candle out. So it's a really nice size as you can see, and I know you can get them engraved as well. I think you get the front or the top engraved or something. So you could always personalise it that way just to make it a bit more special for someone. Um, so badly want to keep this, but I know I definitely don't need any more candles. One of the more pricey things in this gift guide is the GHD Aura hair dryer. Now, if you're like me, you don't really care much about hair dryers. I mean, if it blow dries my hair, then I'm absolutely fine. But I recently tried this and I recently fell in love with it as well. It's about £150 I think. But if there's someone in your family or someone in your life that just always has to have their hair absolutely amazing. I mean if there's someone that's trying to grow out their hair or I don't know just cares a lot about the way that their hair looks then this is awesome because it's got some sort of technology, uh, laminaire technology that basically um, gives you exceptional styling, precision and control. It's quiet, it's got a cool touch, um, 
So it pretty much just does everything that a hair dryer is meant to do. And you can tell how good quality it is because it, it weighs an absolute ton. I think I'm getting some sort of like forearm workout just holding this. If you're looking to buy a gift for a hair lover but don't necessarily want to spend £150 then I mean this Redkin set is awesome. It's like £20 and £50 from Hair Trade I think. And obviously you get the two Redkin um, conditioner and shampoo. This is the, what type is it? Extreme, I think it's just extreme so it just works extra hard. This set in particular comes with a Maybelline mascara. This is the Big Eyes that has the upper lashes and the lower lashes. So um, again, an all rounder for beauty lovers in general. Um, for 20 quid, you can't really go wrong. When you get two Lux hair products, then you get a mascara. So I just think if you, even if you don't really know someone that well, um, maybe for Secret Santa, if, you, if you're spending around the 20 pounds mark, then this is probably a great gift for pretty much anyone. Not sure how many guys generally wear mascara, but if you do, then fair play. So the last product is something else that's around the £20 mark, it's the Soap and Glory, the Supremes, and I just think this kit is just awesome. Um, it's got the Cozy Socks, the Righteous Butter, the Scrub of Your Life, Clean On Me, Heal Genius and Hand Food, and a Scrubby Thing, and I absolutely love these Scrubby Things so much. I don't really know many girls that don't like Soap and Glory as a brand. Um, so I don't think you can really go wrong with this. It hasn't got anything that's kind of specific to anyone in general. I mean, most people tend to moisturise, most people tend to wash, hopefully. And you can just feel how much product is in here by the weight. Um, I'm gonna have to put this down, I think. But yeah, I just, I would personally love to have this for Christmas. Um, I think it's great for younger people, maybe like young teenagers, up to like mums. I just think it's just a great all-rounder and perfect for People who don't know who to buy for, and I don't know what I'm saying. So I hope you enjoyed watching this video. This will probably be my last of the Christmas gift guides. I might maybe possibly do some sort of Christmas makeup tutorial, but again, it's just gonna be all of this with maybe a red lipstick that I feel really uncomfortable with wearing, so. As always, please give this video a big thumbs up. It really makes my day and subscribing makes my day even better. So if you want to see more of me, if you want to hang out with me and my candles, then um, please click subscribe. So I hope you're having a good day and I will see you in my next video. Bye.